Tiny, the Shih Tzu, touched hearts all over Vancouver Island. The little dog with the big fight ahead of her. As you'll recall, we told you her story. She was infested with maggots near death, and despite the best efforts of the SPCA, the little dog could not be nursed back to health. Tiny was euthanized earlier this month, and now charges of animal cruelty have been laid against her former owners. CTV's Stephanie Sherlock has the story. Right across the street, had I known that, I would have, I can't stand stuff like that. People on Prior Street are in shock. It's disgusting. I can't believe it. Mm -hmm. Right under my nose. Didn't even know it. Little Tiny, the 10-year-old Shih Tzu found badly neglected and near death in August, lived here. This is Doug Pattison. He and his wife Enza Pattison are now charged with animal cruelty. My wife is actually the uh, uh, primary owner was the primary owner. The little dog we first introduced you to in August was too weak to overcome her injuries. She was put down earlier this month. It was, it was the only option at that point. Found covered in mats with maggot infested open sores, the sweet little dog touched our hearts. At that point, she was so severely dehydrated and she was emaciated, so her organs had started shutting down. This is, uh, you know, right at the top of the list as far as severity of neglect, yes. So this has been ongoing for quite some time. He called it the worst case of systematic neglect he'd seen. So you had no idea that she was as sick as she was? Well, we, we knew she had diarrhea, and uh, I'd given her uh, a good shampoo uh, after she'd been sick. But hadn't noticed open wounds and maggots. She'd had diarrhea the previous uh, weekend and that's the reason she was outside and my wife was complaining about the smell so I'd, I'd put her out there. Enza Pattison arrived home as CTV News was leaving so we returned to the house on Prior Street to give her a chance to tell her side. Hello. Hi, I'm just wondering if that was your wife, if she was maybe... It might have been. It might have been. Could you, would you mind asking her if she'd like to speak with us? I, I'm afraid she wouldn't right at the moment. Yeah. While neighbours look on in disgust. How you could do that? How could you do that and feel okay? The Pattisons appear in court December 3rd. If convicted, they could face up to five years in jail, up to a $75,000 fine, and a lifetime ban from ever owning animals. Stephanie Sherlock, CTV News, Victoria.